Good morning and welcome to Renew, a daily devotion for you. My name is Nick and this is my wife, Bethany. We're members of Mainland Baptist Church. And today uh, we're going to be bringing a devotion titled The Blessings of Obedience. Our scripture reading this morning will be in Genesis chapter 22, verses 15 through 18. And the angel of the Lord called unto Abraham out of heaven the second time and said, By myself have I sworn, saith the Lord, because thou hast done this thing and not withheld thy son, thine only son, that in blessing I will bless thee, and in multiplying I will multiply thy seed as the stars of the heaven and as the sand which is upon the seashore. And thy seed shall possess the gate of his enemies, and in thy seed shall all the nations of the earth be blessed, because thou hast obeyed my voice. Abraham waited many years for the son God had promised, and he rejoiced when Isaac was born. But Abraham's love for his son did not keep him from obeying when God commanded him to offer Isaac as a sacrifice. He went to the mountain as God directed him and had Isaac on the altar when God told him to stop. Abraham's obedience to prepare to make what must have seemed an overwhelming sacrifice was a result of his faith. Even though there is no account of anyone being resurrected before, Abraham believed God would bring Isaac back to fulfill his promise. A accounting that God was able to raise him up, even from the dead, from whence also he received him in a figure. Hebrews eleven nineteen. Instead, God stopped Abraham from making the sacrifice providing a substitute ram instead. Obedience is always tied to faith. If we do not believe God, we will not do as he says. And if we do not obey God, we will miss out on blessings, not just for our own lives, but for our families, others we impact, and the lives of those they impact as well. We today are still being blessed and benefiting from Abraham's obedience. Often we do not realize the implication of our choices and actions, especially as they relate to those who come after us. But every day we are setting a pattern and leaving an example that will impact those around us as well. As we follow God in faith, our obedience will influence others to trust God as well. Today's growth principle says doing what God says brings blessings to us but also to the others in ways beyond what we can immediately see. We may not always understand exactly why God wants us to do something, but we can always trust that if we just believe that God has it for our best interest, he'll bless it, right? I always like to say God rewards faithfulness, and I'm thankful uh, for the faithfulness of God in my life every single day. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your word. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your mercy, God. I pray that you would use this devotion to help somebody today, God. Thank you for being faithful to us when we're faithful to you, Lord, and always giving us that blessing out of obedience. And we pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen.